Oh, there we go. This is a nicer fish. Ooh, look at that. That right there is a keeper bluegill. going everybody so today is all about urban fishing there's a lot to offer in the Des Moines and Ankeny Altoona areas uh, quite a few ponds city ponds that you can fish and be able to catch a lot of nice fish and a lot of bluegill bass some of them have crappie uh, a few of them have catfish in them pretty good little program that they have it's really nice it's it's actually called fish local you can find uh, find the website for it on the iowadnr.gov and it'll give you every a map of all the ponds, everything that's out there that's public fishing that's in city limits. So it's a pretty cool little program. Check it out, see what you guys can find. Maybe find something that's close to home that you might wanna try out. Pretty good time with the kids. You don't have to ice fish it, but you can always open water fish it as well. So you guys have a good one and hope you enjoy. Somebody had some holes over here already. There is a lot of snow out here. We just had a little over a foot of snow in most areas here in Des Moines. It's been rough, I'll tell you that. So this is actually the first time I've ever been on this pond. I am using a small tungsten. Kind of red speckles on it. Just some waxies. I might try some plastics here in a little bit. And see if I can mark some fish first. Looks like this might be. Oh, here comes something shooting up at it. There he's got it. There we go, a little bit bigger of a gill. That's better. That's almost big enough to keep. Oh, hold still, hold still, hold still. There you go. Back in the water. All right. Let's see what else we can get. There's a lot of fish down here right now. Here comes another one shooting up at it. Got him. I almost wonder if that's the same one. Come on, let go. Let go. Now you're covered in snow. Back in the hole. All right, try again. There's quite a few fish down there. We're gonna go down again. We're gonna see if I can get a bite down here in this brush. Oh yeah, right there. Little guy. No? Not quite little. Decent gill. That one's got more length to them than the rest of them did. Open your mouth. Hmm. That's not bad. Look at the head on him. He's got a little hump already and he's just a small gill. 
All right. Back in the water. Let's try for another one. Here we go, shooting up at it. He's on, little guy. Oh, would you look at that? So this right here, folks, that is flathead bait. Perfect size too. Dang it. If I had a bait tank running at home right now, I'd be taking him home. Oh, there we go. This is a nicer fish. Ooh, look at that. That right there is a keeper bluegill. Holy cow. Hmm. I'd have to catch quite a few of them and make a meal at the moment, though. So... Huh? Oops, shooting up at it. Here we go. Come on out. What still? What still? What a little guy. Torpedo. No. Shooting up at it. Little guy. Oh, no. This one feels good. This is a good fish. I like good bluegill. Look at that. You could just about make a meal out of these. Fish torpedo. Try again. Here we go. Another one. Oh yeah. Ooh. Where's the jig? <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that or not. That jig is gone. I don't have my fish picker with me. Somehow it came off my bibs today. Alright, another one. Not quite big, but he's about a seven inch bluegill. I have kept bluegills that small before, but normally I like keeping about eight inches. Usually that's about the average of what you can find. Um, I do have some ponds I can get nine and occasional ten inches out of, but I try not to pull too many fish out of those. Here comes one. Ooh, they're playing hard to get right now. Ooh, that one's not. Little guy. Oh, not quite. Another nice gill. Looks like I still got a few down here. Here comes one. Not moving too quickly. Oh, here's a whole school of them now. I 
that one's hungry. That feels like another good fish. Well, that was my alarm to go to work, so I'm going to try to catch one more, and then I'm going to head on out of here. Here it comes shooting up. Oh, right out of his mouth. He's going to bite it very hard. Here we go. Try again. He's coming straight up at it. Right out of his mouth. <laughs> There's quite a few over here in this hole. There's a good one. That's a good one right there. Oh yeah. He's not giving me a little action on back.